trains and buses, games and songs. Come join us and sing along. Transit Talks is where I'll be, the coolest place in NYC. Welcome to Transit Talks. Hello, my name is Roberto, and I work at the New York Transit Museum in Brooklyn, New York. And this is Transit Tots, where we think about everything transportation related and how we move around our city. Before we get started with the hello song, let's settle in, make sure we're nice and comfortable in our seats, and let's take a few deep breaths of air in and out together. All right, here we go. Take a nice deep breath of air in, and let it out. Take another breath of air in, and let it out. And let's take one more breath of air in, and let it out. Great! Now we can sing the hello song. If this is your first time at Transit Tots, I'll sing the first time, and then you can sing the second time. All right, here we go. Three, two, one. Hello, 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 and how are you? I'm happy, I'm happy, I hope that you are too. Great! Now let's sing it again, but this time let's say, I feel awake. Can we say that? I feel awake. All right, here we go. Three, two, one. Hello, 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 and how are you? I'm awake, I'm awake, I hope that you are too. Great, everyone. Thank you so much for singing with me. Now, for today's Transit Tots, we're going to think about community, and we're going to focus on skyscrapers. We're going to look at skyscrapers, landmarks, and other buildings in New York City by looking at an artwork together that an artist made. All right, here we go. So today at Transit Tots, we're going to be thinking about New York City's famous skylines. Now, skyscrapers are very tall buildings. Some people thought they were so tall that they would scrape the sky. Now, I want to show you a Lego model of a famous building in New York City. This is the Empire State Building. Have you been to the Empire State Building before? Now, the Empire State Building is in the borough of Manhattan. It's so tall, it's 102 stories up. But if you go to the near the top of it, you can actually see an observation deck and see all the buildings in New York from a distance. Now, skyscrapers are very special because people can work in those skyscrapers. People like to visit them, take pictures from. And in fact, I actually have something that we can look at together. Now, usually people take pictures with their phones. Uh, they use the camera on their phones. But sometimes people like to use pictures with the special camera. Can you all say cheese? Cheese. A lot of people come to New York City who are from all around the world. And they like to bring their cameras and take pictures in front of very famous buildings and landmarks like the Empire State Building. We're going to look at an MTA Arts and Design poster together, and then we're going to make our own skyscraper or famous landmarks just from using things around the house. Let's do that now. We're now going to look at an MTA Arts and Design poster by an artist named Boyun Kim. It is called Our Town. Let's take a close look and share what we see. What do you see here? I see there's many buildings in this poster. There are a lot of colors that are used. There's a hot air balloon at the very top of the poster. There's an elevated train in the center. And at the very bottom, there looks like there's a park where people can go and play. The building on the far left, that one's supposed to be the Empire State Building. It is a very tall building, a very famous skyscraper in New York, it has 102 floors. The building on the far right, that building is the Chrysler Building. It's also a very tall skyscraper too. It has 77 floors. Looking at some of the buildings, I noticed that they have antennas. They have a lot of windows. And some of them even have water towers on top of them. 
Thank you for exploring this artwork with me. What we're going to do now is make our own skyscraper or landmark. We can either use a piece of paper or we can use a lot of cardboard boxes to recreate them. Here we go. For this art activity, where we make our own skyscraper or famous building, you're going to need a few things. You're going to need cardboard boxes, like the one I have over here. You'll also need some glue and markers or crayons. So you can decorate your skyscrapers and add windows or doors. So I have a glue stick here. I have a marker here as well. You can also get paper towel rolls or toilet paper rolls. And these can be maybe antenna, for instance. Perhaps they are water towers for the top of your apartment buildings that you want to make. Or if you're making statues, maybe this can be a certain famous statue like the Statue of Liberty. And then at the very end, get a piece of paper with your family. You can write down a way that you travel to that famous landmark or famous skyscraper. So I'm going to say about a famous place that people like to visit in New York is the Statue of Liberty. The way that I get there is by ferry. So I'm going to write, I take the ferry to the Statue of Liberty. And if you want, you can add color and draw to it as well. So why don't we test this out? Let's see what kind of building I make for New York City. Wow, that was really fun, everybody. I had a good time making a skyscraper, and I hope you had a good time seeing me make that too, from just using materials from around my home. Now, let's review what we did today at Transit Tots. We sang the Hello song together. We looked at an MTA Arts and Design poster by Bo Yum Kim called Our Town. After that, I got to build my own skyscraper with materials, and then I pretended with my little camera here that I was a tourist in my own backyard. I hope that you get to make your own wonderful skyscrapers, landmarks, and buildings in your home, and you get to pretend that you're traveling around like a tourist too. Thank you again, and I hope you get to join us for more Transit Tots adventures on Tuesdays and Thursdays. Take care. Trains and buses.